Hi right, guys, Danny from Inglorious Fishing. It's the day after New Year's Day, and we're down at the beach. It's ten past midnight, and we're going for some warmers, guys. Now we're with First Smash. Trip, baby. We're with Smash Fishing. <laughs> Smash Fishing's making his own video. I've just tagged along. Um, I was going to come here, and uh, I text Smash, and I said, "Oh, what, what are you doing?" He said, oh, "I'm going to this spot." I said, "Damn, that's where I was going. Great minds think alike." He the said, more the yeah, He said, "Come along." So anyway, guys, <laughs> hopefully we make it an epic one, and hopefully we get ourselves a few warmers. Let's go and get them, baby. It's coastal foraging, the first one. Let's go. So guys, we're on the walk. Sorry if you're not you're not going to see a lot at the moment, but uh, I'm on the walk down. I'll give you a glimpse once we get to the pools. Walking over the beds with Smash. Wayne's behind us. The Ormus here, we coming. Can't mess with the Ormus. Wayne is the ultimate Ormus catcher, guys. You've never seen anything like it. There's no such thing as waders when he's involved. There's no waders. <laughs> he's literally jeans jumper and jumping in. He's mad. Anyway, let's we'll start getting to the Ormus beds. Let's get him. So guys, first Orma there, check the size of that one out. That's an absolute beauty. Be having that one all day long, guys. Just check it for measure. It's well in. Absolutely well in. So uh, that's the first one, guys. We'll have that one off. Get him off. Get him in the bag. And hopefully we can get some more of these beauties. Check that out, baby. Lovely. Let's get some more. Another small one there, guys. That's far too small, that one. We'll make sure it gets back nicely for that back. But it's good to see that they are around here, so we're going to keep pulling off a few of these rocks. And hopefully, we don't have to pull up the big ones, guys. They're building the small ones as well. We'll pull a few of these, and hopefully, we can find one, guys. I'll bring you back if we get some. So, guys, second Orma is just down there. I think that's going to be inside, so I'm going to quickly get it off. and we'll see if it is. I'm pretty sure it is. It's a nice one. Nah. Second Orma, guys. And it's a keeper. It's well in. Check that out, guys. Look at that. That is well in. So that's the second Orma. Let's get that rock over and see if there's any more. So, guys, same area. Third Orma. I've just measured it. It's well in size. Absolutely beautiful. That's straight. Let's get some more. I don't know if I can get that on the camera for you, I'll just move my bag. Another little warmer there. Fantastic, beautiful, absolutely fantastic, but that's too small. We'll stop rummage through here and hopefully we can find his mum and dad. So guys, fourth warmer of the knot there. Oh, check that beauty out. Just saws of that one out, guys. That's an absolute beauty. Now I'll just check it with the gauge. close actually I'll tell you what it was too small I think that was too small guys it's just on the bottom we'll have a look it's easier to take them off and check there we go we do put them in the gauge there just in guys look so you go to the back of the Orma like that and then look it's scraping it in if I push it in it pushes the plastic out that's a keeper that's number four guys beauty get some more number five guys check that out we're getting them now let's get going number two more there guys but these are too small so we're gonna get these back nicely behind the rock the shame Hopefully there's a few more. I seem to have found the spot now, guys. You beauty. Another small one there, guys. Too small, that one. So I just come into a rock pool there, guys. And, um, yeah, I've seen this one. So that's number six. Let's get some more. Love it. I'm absolutely loving it, guys. You can't beat this. Foraging at night time with your good mate Smash Fishing. Oh, my God, guys. Look at that thing moving. That's one of the biggest ormers i've ever seen look at it moving guys dirty sea snails got another sort of crab here that's a beauty look at him moving see him moving guys that's him eating the seaweed we're gonna get him off that's the biggest so far let's get him pop look at the size of that thing 
Fantastic. Let's go get some more, guys. You beauty. There's another one there, guys. Just from uh, up from where I just caught that big one. Another one there. Fantastic. There it is. Beautiful. But that's going to go back. It's too small. Put that back. Live with another day. Oh, guys. Just spotted it there. Little top knot. Lovely little flatfish. Beautiful. They stick to the bottom of rocks. They're not very good teeth, them. Uh, according to Smash. Lovely to see, though, guys. Lovely little flatfish. It's a beauty. Check that out. It's a lovely fish, guys. We'll get him back. Off he goes. It's some more abalones. Oh, God, some little spiny starfish there. Good to see. We'll get him back. Come on, let's get some more ormers, guys. We need them. So, guys, I was just lifting the rocks up. And look at that. We found another top knot. We got another ormer. We're getting a lot of the ormers now, guys. We certainly uh, getting them now. So I'm going to put the top knot back, put the rock back. We'll try and find some more of these abalone. We're getting a few. Let's get them. Woo! Got another ormer there, guys. Look on the rock there. That's a nice ormer. We're going to get that one off of the... Uh, it's my prong. What I like doing, I like just sticking the gauge underneath. I find it a lot easier. So I stick the gauge under. Job done. Don't damage him. Get them up nice and easy. That's a fantastic ormer. Beautiful. We got a fair few now, guys. Look at that beast in there. That's a clonker, that one. Anyway, let's get some more, guys. I'm going to get this in the bag, get this rock back, and get some more. Well, oh, guys, another ormer there. I don't know if you can see it. Check the size of that one out. That's another absolute beauty. Uh, get that off. Come on. There you go. Look at the size of that thing. That is massive, guys. Beauty. We'll get that in. Getting a fair few now, guys. I haven't been recording all of them. But we're certainly getting a bag full now. Woohoo! Call me Smash Fishing because I just got myself a lobster, baby. Yeah. Too small that, guys, but it's great to see. Lovely lobster. Beautiful. We're going to get that back and get some more of these ormers. We've got a bag full now. I thought there weren't any. No, we were in the wrong pool. I went to the other one, look at that, it's a burn. Oh, oh, oh. I went the wrong place there. He's got a wing, it's really nice. Look at the size of some of these. Yeah, he's got some monsters in there, I've got some beauties as well. Well guys, we're walking back up to the van now. I've got enough ormers, I've got 16. Smash reckons he's got about 30, so... I've got about 30 and a decent lobster. That's right, three dozen. Yeah, and a nice lobster. Down, eh? Yeah, not bad at all, mate. Love family it. sorted. That was a good night. Let's get back up to the van, guys. I'll give you a glimpse of the abalone once we get up there. It's been a cracking night. Loved it. Foraging, baby. Well, guys, we're back up to the van. There's mine now. I've got 16 almonds there. Smash has got 24 and a lovely lobster. Check that out. He had a right forage. That was a beauty of a lobster to get straight away, eh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's a beauty, mate. Walking along. Just walking along and he's seen it bang and he had it. The lobster king struck again. So yeah guys, fantastic forage, absolutely chuffed with that. I'll be going out again tomorrow. Smash would definitely be going oh, out yeah. tomorrow. All my season, baby. And yeah, fantastic guys. So uh, I'm gonna check these ormers now. So guys, I'm just gonna go over them like this. I know they're all in because uh, I measured them down there. So yeah, they're all in guys. I'm not gonna have to check all of them, but yeah, fantastic. So probably enjoyable forage. Might be with Smash next time, who knows? You never know. Wayne the Ormer Seal, providing the copper teas, Beautiful. fantastic. So yeah, guys, we'll see you on the next one. I hope you enjoyed it. Coastal foraging within glorious, baby. Ormer season. Hi guys, Danny from Inglorious Fishing. It's currently the first day of Ormer and season. It's the morning after the night session with Smash Fishing. And we're down here, down Perel now. It is absolutely jam-packed, guys. There's cars everywhere. So stay tuned. I'm going to get down there and hopefully we can get a few of these abalone. Let's go get them. Well, guys, it's blowing a hoolie. We've got the whole brigade here. We've got Sam T, Southwest Sellers, Smash Fishers walking in front. It's pandemonium down here already. That's a lot. There is a lot of people. I apologise for any of the wind noise, guys. It's going to be windy today. I've got you on the tripod. The causeway is just uncovered over there, as you can see. 
that leads to a little island where there's a little uh, private house called Leo House. And yeah, we're gonna get over there, guys, and get to it. Let's go get these abalone, baby. So guys, just walking down the headland. Got to be a uh, bit aware of yourself around here, guys, because it's pretty treacherous. So big boulders, big um, hazards. So uh, oh, look at that. What's that? A dead rabbit. That's not good. Oh, smash! We'll cook that. Catch and cook. So we're guys, just getting to the shoreline now. Smash is well in front. As you can see, it's just boulders and just lots of weed everywhere, guys. And all we're literally doing is turning the boulders, looking for these sea snails. Fantastic tradition in Guernsey, guys. We absolutely love it. So let's get to it. Let's see if we can get some. First one over there, guys. Little one. That's not going to be big enough. We'll get that back. Smashing just down the top one, I think. So that's great. We're gonna just um, have a little trawl around here, guys, flipping rocks, seeing what we can find. You never know when you're gonna find them. There's not many there. Uh, we'll look around here. I'll bring you back if we find some, guys. Oh, it's just got an ormer there. Unfortunately, it's too small, this ormer, so it's going to have to go back. There's another little one on the rock with it, but, um, yeah, going to have to get that back. Oh, look, guys, there's another one. Look, I didn't even see that. Check that out. There's a big one I nearly missed. There you are, guys. Look, I'm going to put that one back. Look, I missed one. There you are. That's a better one. That one's definitely in size. That's the first ormer of the day. Have that. Right. Let's see if we can get some more, guys. That was a beauty. We put him back so he's nice and safe, ready for next year. Look at that. Well, guys, just got one here. Unfortunately, it's broke as I was getting off, but it's still in size, so we'll be taking that one. And that's still another one, baby. That's number two. Let's get some more. Well, guys, I did just have a small one. I don't know what I was going to show you, but uh, I dropped it. I took a swim before. Well guys, we just, me and Sam, I asked Sam, give me a hand, we just turned this one over and we got one, two, three, four. Only one's gonna be a keeper though, guys. But look, fantastic things. I'm gonna get this big one off. Get my, uh, get my little poke out. I prefer, I prefer this to get them off. The actual gauge. Oh, is it? Yeah, just run the gauge underneath it. Like that. And I'll find you don't break them, guys. There you are. That's a nice ormer, that one. Check the size of that thing. Look at that. That's a beauty. That's going straight in the bag. Get that in. Do you want to give me a hand trying to flip it over? Yeah. Just because there's little ones on it. And get it back. So she always turn your rocks back over, guys. Always. So we're going to turn this one back. Look. Little starfish as well. Brittle star, is it? Yep. Yeah. Sad though. Nice. Back to live another day. Let's go and get some more, baby. Oh, guys, another one there. That one's too small, that one on the gauge. So that one's going to have to go back, unfortunately. But good to see that they're around here, guys. That's good to see. Let's get that rock back and uh, try and get some more. Hopefully, we can get some. Uh, pretty hard going at the moment, to be fair. Oh, we've got a nice one here, guys. I think. We'll have a look. Let's see if I can lift the rock up. There he is, guys. We'll check that one, though. I'm not sure if that's going to be in. No, he's under. That one's under as well, guys. Yeah. Yeah, that one's definitely on that. Back that one goes. Well, it's good to know they're around here, guys. I'm going to keep searching through here and hopefully we can get some. A small one again guys there's lots of small ones around here but no big ones we're gonna get that back and uh, keep turning these rocks hopefully we can get ourselves a big one okay guys we've just found our fourth keeper of the day look at the coloration on that that's a beautiful warmer fantastic we're starting to get some now we found a little pool here that me and southwest sellers are starting to cane so uh we'll bring you back if we get any more 
Another little one there, guys. This is fantastic to see. There's lots of little ones, loads of them, absolutely loads of them. It's good to see the diversity of the Ormers are still alive and well. Uh, that's what happened. Yeah. The nice one here. Just turned over this rock, guys, and as I turned it over, I picked it up. It was in my hand. Let's get this one off. Come here. I have to use my gauge, guys. I think this one's gonna be in. There we are, check that out. Beautifully in. Be taking that. Right, I'm not gonna move from this pool. I'm gonna uh, give a good rummage around here, guys, because we've had a few. And there's lots of little ones, so. There's another one here, look. Another nice one. There we are, guys. It's another keeper. Uh, Uh, I don't know, measure it. Yeah, just under. Yeah. We're getting a fair few now, guys. Let's go for it. Two there, guys. Great to see on the rock what they look like they just feed on the rocks eating all the seaweed and stuff like that all the bacteria and they eat that fantastic get that back okay. yeah look Dick southwest salad's got a nice one there guys it's taking all our orders fantastic all these have been turned look Oh, these have been turned. That one hasn't. No measuring that one, that's a beauty. Not oh, big, big, but... Big enough. Just turning all the rocks that have been missed. Well in. Another beauty there, guys. We're getting a few now what it's all about. All I'm doing is just turn and rock that hasn't been turned. That one's just out guys, that one. Put that one back. Another one, too small. Oh yeah, bring you back if you get any more. Another beauty guys, check that out. That's a monster. That is a monster. Alright, oh, better collect them before other people get them. Let's get to it. Get a few out of this pool, that's for sure. I'm gonna keep working it, guys. I reckon there's a fair few more in here because this doesn't look like it's been worked at all, not properly. So we're gonna keep going. Doesn't look worked at all. At all. Well guys, just picked up this rock. That one's far too small, but these two are both in size, so that was good. I'm gonna keep get these all forage around here and hopefully you can get a few more guys. Fantastic. Sorry about the lens. Well guys, just turn this rock over and look at that for a beauty. Look at the size of that one guys, that is an absolute beast of an armor. Get the odd one off as well, which is just down here. Just check that for gauge, because you don't want to take no undersized ones up. Oh look, I've just, because I've hit it, it's, totally it's knocked it. So we've put that one back now guys. Fantastic, let's get some more. Well guys, we're on the walk back up now. That was a thoroughly enjoyable forage, but it is absolutely trenching down with rain. Um, Smash Fishing's already started the walk up to the van, so we'll meet up with him and we'll give a count of the Ormers and see how many we got when we're up at the van, guys. But at the moment, it's blowing a hoolie and the rain's coming down, so I need to get out of here. So guys, we're back at the van now. Like I say, I apologise for the wind noise, but I've counted up the Ormers and we've got 40 Ormers down there. We didn't do too bad at all, guys, so absolutely fantastic i'm really chuffed with that this one's trying to make a run for it but yeah great some nice sized ormers there um two hours work weren't too hard so not too bad guys not too bad but uh if you like this sort of content make sure you hit that like button make sure you hit that subscribe button as well guys really appreciate it if you could do that it costs nothing and we'll see you on the next adventure hopefully it's turbot time see you next time guys thanks for watching